Hello everybody, welcome back to the Horror Vault. Today, I have these out, so you know what that means. It's unboxing time, and this time, it's Colossal Crate. Those who don't know, Colossal Crate is a UK subscription service. It costs about £19.99. Um, do ship internationally, I believe. I'll leave a link down below in the description box for you to check out. They do all sorts of different boxes, general geeky stuff, DC, uh, gaming, Marvel, horror, I get the general geeky box and the horror box. Unsure what, which one this is until we open it, so let us crack on and get this box open. Think if it is if it's not the horror one, the general geeky box will be um themed of some sort. Villains? I think it's villains, that should be right. So this is the November box. November box. So, right, go okay, first thing. First thing is uh, is, uh, is a book. Look at it. Oh, it's just, a, it's just a notepad. General notepad. It'll come in handy. Everybody uses notepads. So, it's the minions. Most people like the minions. Obviously from Despicable Me. But yeah, that's just what it's like inside. There is no fancy uh, emblem in the corner or anything. It's just a general notepad. Next thing in here is... What on earth is that? I'll take that. Oh, it's... <laughs> it's a Harley Quinn bath duck. So, there we go. Well, my daughters were like this. She big fan of uh, Harlequin, so she'd be happy with this. <laughs> right. Yeah, I'd say this is the general geeky box. This is the villain box. Actually, it's a pretty cool uh, thing to this so far. It's a DC thing. Minions. This is a Star Wars mug. So. One mug, I say, tumbler, glass. Guess the glass. That's what it looks like. So cold and room temperature. So changes with uh, stuff. So let's uh, let's get it open and see what it looks like. Is it glass? It is glass. It's, uh, it is actually glass. So there you go. It's quite a well. That's a death trooper, isn't it? And then on the other side, Rogue One, Star Wars. Yeah. So looks like it's this color. So that's, what's that? Oh, sorry, I thought there was something on it. It's um yeah. So it's just nothing inside. It's just glass. So it looks like it's this color. And then when you uh, put, I guess, cold water in it, for best colour change results, wash with warm water to set products to room temperature, then fill with ice cold water. So yeah, it looks like it's probably that. And then it changes into that sort of whitey grey colour. But that's pretty cool. I don't know how much these were when they first came out, but I'm quite happy with that. Could always do with a new glass. Two more things in here, I think. I feel like two more things. We'll go with this rectangular box. And it is. Oh! That's oh, a box. Oh, cool. I don't know what this is from. Bug Cat. Cartoon Hangover, Bravest Warriors. I've never heard of this. Created by Pendleton Ward. Catch Bravest Warriors on Cartoon Hangover. It's all the animation pop, super stylized vinyl figures. No, nope, I've never heard of this, but it's an underground toys exclusive. So that's what it looks like. And I'm sure, as uh, some of you have probably seen this, I have actually no idea what it's from, obviously, other than what it says on the box, but I can't say much more than that. But last thing in here, yep, last thing. Just a pop wrap, nothing else in the box. So you got one, two, three, four, five things. 
The last thing is a t-shirt, which I'm hoping is one my size, two, yeah, it's my size, and it is. Is it a good t-shirt? Is it a bad t-shirt? What have we got? Oh, uh, appropri uh, appropriately popular at the moment. So it's either, it says, uh, you either die a mortal, you live long enough to see yourself become a Rick. That's not Steve from Rick and Morty show. That's quite cool. I think that's quite an easy, quite simple uh, t-shirt, but it's, it's pretty decent. And it's thick, which is obviously needed for this weather. Hence, body war, gloves, heaters on. But, yeah, I'm quite happy with that. So, you know, one, two, three, four, five things in here. I think the value of this box is definitely here this, this month. So you got the Rick and Morty t-shirt. Which I haven't watched any of yet, but I keep getting told to. And it's supposed to be really, really good. Let me know in the comments down below which episode I start with. Probably more likely start with the first episode. But there is, a, is there any I should just... I'll just catch it any time and just watch it, see what it's like. So you hit the t-shirt. You have the a notebook, which will get used. Um, the Harlequin bath duck. Which, again, this will be used by my daughter when she's in the, in the bath. The colour changing glass, which I'm quite happy with. It's quite a, you know, good size cup. I mean, here's a cup. So, yeah. So, it's a decent size glass. And we have the Funko Pop, which, as you can tell from behind me, I do collect Funko Pops. There's a load of other ones dotted all over the place, but... Um, I don't know what this is from other than what it says on the box. So, I'll have to check this out and see what it is. But, yeah, I'm actually quite happy with this box. This is a really good uh, box set. It was all villains, as you can probably tell. But let me know in the comments down below what you thought of this box and whether they should have put any other villains in it. What do you think of Rick and Morty? Do you, should I watch this, Bravest Warriors? Is it worth watching? What do you think of the new Star Wars, if you've seen it? All these sort of things. Let me know in the comments down below. As always, if you haven't subscribed, hit the big red subscribe button down below and you can see more unboxings and all sorts of things, Funko Pops and Horror Talks and all sorts of things on this channel. Um, click like if you like the video. And as I always say, thanks for watching and I'll see you next video. Bye for now.